she felt God wanted her there. She felt this was her destiny. She felt she was born to rule. I think she is actually an extraordinary woman, Elizabeth. Well, England, the Queen is all yours. Our story starts halfway through her reign. She knew that she was an incredibly powerful political tool. When Elizabeth came to the throne, the aim of the whole of Europe was to reconquer England and turn it back into a Catholic country. The most important aspect of this particular production is how closely intertwined personalities were with the politics. She's facing her last chance at presenting herself as a catch. We beg to raise the question of your marriage. So long as you do not come to me to complain about your wives, I am content. <laughs> One of the reasons this was so important was the question of succession. I could not marry you. I could not raise up a subject, so. Kiss me, Helen Mirren is such a wonderful, energetic, sexy actress. Quicksilver mood changes, great life, and that's our Elizabeth. Jeremy, who I've never worked with before, he's brilliantly well cast in this. His wit, his sophistication, his elegance, his slightly wicked Lothario kind of element. And then Hugh, obviously he was much younger than she was. He came into Elizabeth's life when she was approaching 50. He was probably 18. And from that point onwards, he was the most uh, important, influential, powerful man in her court. It was an, a mad infatuation. You know you shouldn't be engaged in, but you can't stop yourself. Your Majesty knows the secrets of my heart. I'm damned if I do, sir. In the middle of this political world, something really personal went between them. And that's the sexy thing for me. Every time he kisses her, or every time she kisses him, they're both running a terrible, terrible risk. <laughs> Anything that's historical you know, makes you see your situation in today's life more clearly. The world is governed by powerful, sometimes dangerous, brilliant personalities. And these are the people that shape our era, and they're the kind of people that were shaping that era as well. Within the landscape of these huge historical events, you have a very personal story of a woman and the men around her who have feelings and vulnerabilities and fears and loves.